We've claimed territory from Wei, and now we've repelled their colossal army. The world knows all about the strength of Shu now, right, Father? Absolutely. There's no one who can stop us now. And you're really starting to look the part of a great leader too, brother. I'm no great leader. It's you who are supporting me through this. I couldn't do it without you. No. You are more than worthy of being considered king of our land, my lord. In fact, I heartily recommend that you take this opportunity to declare yourself king of Hanjong to the entire land. King of Hanjong? It is a way for us to show to the people of our land and to those in the other kingdoms that we are a force at least equal in scale to Wei and Wu. The land has been divided in three. Our next step is to gradually expand Master Liu Bei's influence so that his vision dominates the land as a whole. King of Hanjong. That sounds pretty good to me. Uh, I guess that'd make me a prince then, huh? And we'd be in the king's loyal retainers. I feel like I'm going up in the world. Remember, brother didn't become king so we could go around boasting about our new ranks. It's all to help as many people as possible. We can't forget that. There's one other thing that we mustn't forget. As Master Jugo Leon said, the land has now been divided in three. In other words, we are now ready to join forces with U and fight against Wei. Yes, I remember the plan. There was a certain amount of disagreement with Master Sun Chuan over the land of Jing province, but that will shortly be solved. Soon, I intend to return the two remaining counties of Jing province to Wu as well. Wait, just a minute! We won that land fair and square! Besides, what's gonna happen to Guan Yu? Jin province has served dual purposes as a foothold to claim Yi province and to keep Wei at bay. Now that we have secured Yi province and solidified our territorial base, its only function is to keep Wei in check. If we claim Shun Un, then it will not be needed for that either. And if that happens, Master Guan Yu's task will be complete and he can return to Chengdu. The three of you will be together again. Doesn't that sound good? Yeah, when you put it like that, it does. Ever since that day in the Peach Garden, we've shared our burden between the three of us. It is always unpleasant to be apart. We must do all that we can to ensure our reunion happens sooner rather than later. Liu Bei successfully repels Cao Cao's invasion of Hanjong. With this victory, he takes for himself the title of Lord of Hanjong. In Jing, Guan Yu receives word of Liu Bei's victory and decides the time was right to attack Wei. He chooses Fan Castle as his target. With that, he fell right into Cao Cao's trap. By drawing Guan Yu out and defeating him, Cao Cao aimed to disrupt the fragile balance between the three kingdoms. All else had been to ensure the success of the campaign against Guan Yu. 
And to do so, he enlisted the aid of Sun Quan, who had long desired the return of Jing province. Wei will not attack Hanjon for some time now. If anywhere, their next target will surely be Jin province. There are already reports of movement from the Wei forces. I propose that we counteract them by striking first. You mean you want Guan Yu to attack Wei? But Jing province only has enough troops to defend it. <laughs> I don't think they have enough to initiate an invasion. Of course not. That's why I'd like to ask Master Fa Zheng to head to Jin province. I am sure that just as he did in the siege of Hanjong, Master Fa Zheng will perform most meritoriously. What's the matter, Fa Zheng? I'm sorry. I've just been feeling a little foggy-headed recently. Maybe it's true that vengeance takes its toll on the body. You must not overdo things, Fa Zheng. We cannot afford for anything to happen to you. Zhuge Liang, perhaps we should send someone else to Jing province instead. Yes, perhaps you're right. We may have asked too much of you recently, Master Fa Zheng. I think you should rest for a while. You don't need to worry about me. I'll be fine after a short nap. But Jin Province is a long way away. I'll take care of some business I have in Chengdu instead. I'm worried about him. He just won't rest, no matter how often we ask him to. Who do you intend to send to Jing province instead? I would like to go myself, but bearing in mind Master Fa Zhang's physical condition, it would be unwise for me to leave Chengdu at the moment. Most of our other officers are busy rebuilding their forces after the battle to secure Hanjong. I think, therefore, that I will simply send Master Guan Yu a letter outlining the strategy I would like him to adopt. I'm sure Guan Yu will appreciate that. I have not seen him for some time. Were it not for my position, I would have liked to have gone to Jing province myself. Master Liu Bei. Another time, maybe. I would very much like to stand on the battlefield alongside my sworn brothers once again. I see. Actually, I need your help. Saved me. I can. 
cannot thank you enough. Please take this. May this victory bring us closer to our goals. Yes. Excuse me. Thanks! Messengers report that Master Guan Yu has successfully executed a flood attack on Fan Castle, and has claimed control of the area. They say his children fought bravely alongside him as well. Oh, that is wonderful news! It is splendid to hear that Guan Yu's children have grown up so strong and dependable. The future of the kingdom looks bright, Fa Zheng. Congratulations, my lord. Fa Zheng, you look worse every day. You must take some time to rest and recover. Master Jugo Leong, I wonder if I could be allowed to talk to Master Liu Bei. Alone for a while. Would you mind excusing us? Master Liu Bei. Please refrain from telling me I need to rest in front of the other retainers. Treating me as an invalid only exposes me to either unnecessary sympathy or ridicule. I'm simply worried about you. I cannot afford for anything to happen to you, you know. Death comes to us all. You should save your concern for the future of the land. Master Guan Yu is in Fan Castle. 
If Wu has designs on removing him from Jin province, they will not let this opportunity pass. Fa Zheng, do you seriously believe that Wu will betray us, join forces with Wei, and slay Guan Yu? Cao Cao paid a visit to Hong Zhong. That is a clear indication that some kind of agreement was reached between them. Wu has always desired division of the land in two parts. Shu has always been an obstacle to that. If it were me, I would get rid of Master Guan Yu first. But then... Then we must warn Guan Yu at once. We must send reinforcements. That's exactly what Wei wants us to do. If we send men and leave Yi province underprotected, they will break through Hangzhou and come straight for Chengdu. The die has already been cast. It cannot be stopped now until the world sees what number's been rolled. But... but Guan Yu... It... Master Liu Bei, I will give you one piece of advice. If it does come to pass that Master Guan Yu is slain, you must not allow yourself to pursue revenge. If you had a villain like me by your side, then it might just work. But without me, you're simply too kind. Fa Zheng? Fa Zheng! Oh no! Sorry about that. Thanks! Be careful. No, Guan Yu. Guan Yu! How could you go first and leave your brothers behind? I beg your forgiveness, my lord. If we had been stronger... No, Master Liu Bei. The blame lies entirely with me. I knew there was always a chance that Wu would attack Master Guan Yu. I should have sent him more troops to prepare for that eventuality. 
No one here must bear the blame for Guan Yu's death. This was an act of evil and treachery by the men of Wu. The only one who deserves our hatred and our vengeance is Sun Quan. Brother, what's happened? Why did Sun Quan betray us? I... but we... we swore an oath! We swore that though we were born on different days, the day of our death would be one and the same. We have lost more than just Master Guan Yu. Master Guan Ping and Master Zhou Zan wanted to see us build a land of benevolence too. And after taking Hung Zhang and forcing Wei to the brink, I thought that day was close. Everyone, I would like you all to observe a period of mourning for Guan Yu, Guan Ping, Zhou Tsang, and all the soldiers who fell at Fan Castle. They were brave men who fought and died for our dream of a land of virtue and benevolence. That dream, however, does not die with them, but lives on in us. Fa Zheng said that I am incapable of vengeance. But I am not a saint. I've lost my beloved brother to an act of treachery and craven cowardice. I cannot simply sit here and do nothing! Sun Quan! This debt will be paid! Guan Yu, god of war, fell at my castle. As promised, Sun Quan receives a large portion of Jing province for cooperating with Cao Cao. However, the cost of breaking the alliance with Shu and killing Liu Bei's sworn brother would not be small. With the alliance gone, the united stance against Wei fell apart. Elsewhere, Having witnessed the changes he had planned, Cao Cao quietly drew his last breath. He entrusted the future to his son, Cao Pi. The world of the Three Kingdoms was about to enter a new phase. I hear more and more voices within the castle, saying that we should attack Wu. Not only the soldiers, but the ordinary people of Yi province are also calling for us to avenge Master Guan Yu. Master Liu Bei, I do not think it wise to allow anger to drive us to conflict with Wu. We must repair our relationship with Wu and return the land to its state of division in three parts. As a ruler, that is most certainly what I should do. But as a brother... Brother! What are you doing just standing around? It's time for battle! I'm going to crush every last one of those ooh scum! I understand your pain, Master Zhang Fei. But we cannot just... What would you know? The three of us swore an oath that we would die on the same day. Our sworn brother, who shared our dream and fought alongside us, has been cruelly betrayed and killed. We can't just let that stand. Master Zhang Fei, calm yourself, please. If we wage war with Wu now, Master Liu Bei's future will be compromised. Surely, neither you nor Master Guan Yu would want that. You want to know what I want? I want to destroy Wu! They showed no respect for us or for our brother's dream! We don't need them in our brother's land! Isn't that right, brother? Until now, I have fought with a singular desire to save the people I see suffering in front of my eyes. 
But at the same time, I have seen so many die before me, sacrificed for my sake. Guan Yu fought to the very last and died for the sake of the dream we three shared. It is my duty to bring that dream to reality. Zhuge Liang, Zhao Yun, prepare for battle at once. It is clear that the men of Wu do not share our vision. In which case, they must be slain. I must slay them for the sake of those who have died for me. Master Liu Bei, I implore you. Do not make me repeat myself. Make your preparations. We will go to war against U. Master Liu Bei is a man for whom his vision is everything. There is nothing I can say to dissuade him from this course of action. But, Fa Zheng, you were just the kind of explosive influence who might have been able to do so. Master Zhuge Liang, Hey! Someone, come here! My lord! We're going to battle to crush those ooze scum! We leave first thing in the morning! Spread the word that all forces are to prepare! Anyone not ready will face my wrath! F first thing in the morning? Is it not possible to have a little more time, my lord? No! We are avenging the death of my sworn brother! I have to be the first out there on the battlefield! But, my lord... I'm heading to the pre-battle banquet. Make sure you're ready by the time the banquet's over. Unless you want to be on the wrong end of my fists as well, that is. Ah. <sighs> Tomorrow, we begin the fight to avenge my brother! Prepare yourselves for that battle! Disrupt our festivities over here. Hey, who sent you? Huh? Come on, why don't you say something? There's another one. Brother. Give me. Zhang Fei... he's... dead? Why? 
Why have you all gone ahead and left me behind? They say his own men killed him after father forced them beyond the limits of what they could take. My father must take some of the blame for what happened. But what riles me is that his killers fled to Ooh afterwards. I can't help but think that the whole thing might have been a Wu plot. In that case, Master Zheng Fei's death was the same as brothers and fathers, the direct result of Wu's betrayal. I cannot forgive the people of Wu for their deceit and trickery. Master Guan Yu and Master Zhang Fei were both fine warriors. It's not right that they should be cut down in the prime of their youth. I will make sure Wu is punished for that terrible crime! I appreciate your passion, everyone. For the sakes of Guan Yu and Zhang Fei, we cannot afford to lose this battle. I am prepared to die if it means our victory. Together, we will ensure that Wu's days are at an end! Guan Yu, Chung Fei, your deaths will be avenged. We will advance to Yi Ling and I will slay Sun Quan with my own hands! Shu can't afford to make an enemy. The Shu forces is nearly overwhelming. It seems sadness has changed that man into a demon driven by sheer rage. We're going to secure this area. Everybody, forward! This area belongs to us now! Belongs to us now! The King of Wu Shi has sent us to see if you're worthy of his trust. Will you collect the items desired by our king? Do so, and we will aid Shu.
You really did collect them all. It seems you are worthy of our trust. Wu is also our enemy. Let us work together to defeat Sun Quan. A success! Great! Very nicely done. You are quite the warrior. I'm Shimok. You're fighting Sun Quan, right? We've also been fighting Wu. We face the same enemy. We can help each other. I'm not joining with weaklings, though. Find what I ask and prove your power! Well, looks like you've got the numbers I need. You're tougher than I thought. You'll find me as good as my word. I'll lend you a hand. A success! Great! Amazing! You sure know how to fight! This area belongs to us now! We must strengthen our defenses! Let's finish them off, shall we? Charge! Resist and intercept the enemy! We have to stop them here! Forces have come to greet us. Now my I hope they don't think they're gonna get past here, though. Your skills are very impressive. Well done. Yeah. 
The timing is right to commence an attack. Very nicely done. You are quite the warrior. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. This is one defeat we can't afford to take. Let's fall back and regroup. May this victory bring us closer to our goals. I knew you were strong, but not this strong. attack is quite fierce. However, I refuse to let them take our supply depot. I don't like the way this thing is going. Maybe it's time we unleashed the ambush unit. Now right. Take I need everyone to defend this area. Capturing that base will weaken the enemy greatly. All units march! We're doing an excellent job. 
I can see my reputation growing fainter each moment. It took a while, but the storehouses are ours. The guards are a lot tougher than I expected. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. May this victory bring us closer to our goals. Dragon's roar! 
We must approach this battle with boundless determination. Summon the supply unit. We cannot afford to run out of provisions. Now's my chance! Take this! Report! The Shu forces have taken our supply depot. We can't form a supply unit. What? When did Shu manage to capture our supply depot? The Shu army is applying pressure to the front lines. Now's my chance! We need to call in reinforcements from Ziggy and trap them in a pincer attack. Report! Ziggy has been taken by the Shu forces. We can't use our pincer attack now. It seems they have beaten us to the punch. I guess their army is not running on sheer rage alone. We are the rulers of Jingnan. We will work with Shu to defeat Sun Twin. The elite forces from the southern tribe, known as the Wu Shi. When did Shu manage to secure an alliance with them? We are going to secure this area. Everybody, forward! Capture one of those unsightly positions. Follow me. I don't really like defending, but I'll do what needs to be done. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! Alright! Stop it already! I can't bear this any longer! Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. Now's my chance! You are doing an excellent job. It's time to take the attack to the enemy. Forward! We're going to secure this area. Everybody, forward! Now, take defensive positions. Take the attack to the enemy! Forward! Dragon's war! Very nicely done. You are quite the warrior. Now's my chance! Take this! Go capture one of those unsightly positions. Follow me. Now's my 
has been determined. Capturing that area. Leo Bay has been consumed by rage. He failed to notice what was happening. We have him right where we want him. What? What does this mean? The time has come. Master Jiran. Hey, Wushu! It's time, right? Crimson flames. Like the path to the future of Sulu. Of it. 